morning world. I'm so exhausted. It is, I don't know, probably like two o'clock and I'm just rolling out of bed and looking like stellar. But yeah, last night um, went rock climbing, which was so much fun. And then went and had some some beers, some quite a few beers. So, so there's that. And uh, yeah, like a nice comment on my last video, totally read all of the comments, was that I drink way too much lately. And mm, no, I really don't think that I do. But anyways, uh, yeah, I have today off. Clearly why I'm being a bum. And uh, I'm hungry, really, really hungry, but I don't want to cook breakfast. But I do want to cook breakfast at the same time. But I really need coffee and I really need salt and pepper. So I think I might run over to the grocery store really quick, get salt and pepper, and get coffee. I want hot coffee though. I guess I could get instant coffee. Ah, I could do that. Okay. Mm, solutions. My plan was this morning to wake up and early and go film the my train station in the morning because my train station is like out of this world bizarre. It's so insanely packed and I really wanted to get up top of the Starbucks that we have and like film it. But yeah, that didn't happen. Um, I plan to do it next week sometime though. It's going to happen. Um, uh, maybe like before school. Yeah. I look like a, an absolute total utter disaster. Pretty sure it's not socially acceptable to go out in public looking like this, but you know what? I really don't care. <laughs> I'm getting to the point where I don't care. So, um, yeah, besides that, I, I don't really have that many plans today. It's, again, another dreary day. It's supposed to rain, so I can't go to the beach. Um, I think I might check out Seaside today, though. Um, my camera's all charged up, so I think I might go hang out and play around with it at Seaside. And, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I have to finish up some laundry, and, yeah, right now I'm going to make breakfast. So I went to the grocery store and I successfully got everything I needed and I went looking like a mess and you know what? I feel okay about it. Probably got to go to Cherry Core, but whatever. Now that I'm back, I'll show you what I got. Um, I got everything I needed, which was like five things plus one extra. No, I think I legit got five things. Let's see. It's probably right there. I'm so hungry and I don't even want to cook because I'm that hungry. I got these fun things, which are like coffee, single pouch, serving, brewing coffee thingamajiggers. Yeah, that. That's some mellow water in. Watermelon. Yum. Thought that would be good. Got some, I think this is soy milk for my coffee. Got some Jane's Crazy Mixed Up Salt for my egg. Got some tiniest little bottle of olive oil ever for again my eggs and then if the coffee sucks I actually like this coffee this is the Dotor do, do, do whatever I don't know looks like donuts but it's totally not and it's the cafe um ole which is like I think a cafe latte I don't know but it's good, so I figured if I fail miserably with coffee, I can just eat or drink that, and I would be happy. So I'm going to cook a big, fun breakfast. I'll show you the results. This is what's going in my omelet. Spinach, which I found out, indeed, is spinach. So, God, my guessing game is on point lately. Pretty freaking stoked. So, I'm getting all the stems, but. Got spinach, got some tomatoes, got my stir-fry pan full of oil. I'm going to go ahead and start my veggies and put in this little number and my coffee should be ready to start making soon. I want an update on this juice. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. It tastes a lot like tomato juice, but it's a cool yeah. contraption. That's coffee. It starts out in this little pouch and you like pop it open and then pour the coffee in there. That is so stinking adorable. It's probably like a fancy instant coffee, but I'm still so stoked to try it. So I think my water ready to go because it is boiling you are my messy apartment okay let's do this struggle oh I think I have to push that stupid button <laughs> this is gonna be a struggle yeah I don't think I can do this on camera how sick is that 
This is so cool. I don't know why I think that's so fascinating, but it's breakfast time. So I just have my little omelet thing with egg and spinach and tomato and cheese and coffee and I'm so excited to eat this. So delicious. Oh, that was so good. I'm so happy I made that. That was my first time making breakfast <clears throat> in Japan. That was the first time me making breakfast in like months because I moved out of my apartment and did it. Oh my god, I haven't made breakfast in so long. So that's delicious. I'm really happy I made it. I will make that again. I have plenty of the ingredients to make it again. And this coffee, it's okay. I'm trying to drink my coffee without sugar in it because no one uses sugar around here. It's strange. It's, it's awful. Um, I'm going to paint my nails because they look like uh, a disaster. And then I'm going to get ready to get my day started to go walk to Seaside. So yeah, that should be fun. I'm excited. I probably have spinach in my teeth. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm just getting ready to start my day that's starting at like 4 o'clock. Um, I figured I'd put on some makeup and go out and walk around. But anyways, I wanted to kind of like vent, low-key vent to you guys because lately I've been having this like reoccurring thing happen to me and I'm going to get to it, I swear. The lighting is really weird right now. But basically... Basically, I've been having this reoccurring thing happen to me where I'll meet people and then I'll hang out with them. Like last night, for instance, this happened and I was like hanging out with someone that I had never met, like or really hung out with before. And um, it's like they have this preconceived notion of what I'm going to be like. And then when they start to like actually find out what I'm like, they're like, oh, I did not think that was how you're going to be. Why do people have this like preconceived notion I think it's really, uh, it's so awful and I hate it because I just feel like you're the awful person for first of all having this preconceived notion that I'm just like, and it's not a, I guess it's not a bad thing, but it's kind of a bad thing. Like people think I'm like, uh, I hate to say this because it sounds slightly conceited, but people have this like preconceived notion of me as like, I'm like dumb I'm like popular in high school I was like prom queen I was like I love like hip-hop and like all this shit which is that's fine I mean whatever if that's your like thing that's cool but like that's not who I am and people just think I'm what I guess when they meet me that I'm just like basic white girl like with no depth to me no like interesting stories no like just they like have this preconceived notion of me and then it's like I don't know it's just so annoying and I hate it and I'm just like why do you assume stuff about me that you don't even know sorry this is slightly ranty and I'm like going off about it but it's like drives me crazy because it's like you don't know me you've judged me which is what you think that I'm like a judgmental sort of person or like I am this way and you've predetermined who I am without even knowing me and like not that I care because it's like that's fine people that don't know me can think that way about me and then the people that do know me actually know that I'm not like a stupid shallow typical girl I guess I don't even know how to explain it but it's like I don't it drives me crazy and how do I get that sort of thing off of you know like out of people's minds like and I don't think I've done anything to really do that but people are like oh like you really you know, like, I don't know. I just feel like I hate when people do that. And that's like the most reoccurring thing. People are like, oh, I didn't expect that out of you. Or, oh, like, I wouldn't have thought you were like that. Or, and I'm just like, what, what did you think I was like? And how did you make this sort of, you know, predetermined thing about me? I think it speaks more for the people than it speaks for myself because I'm just like, Okay, you think you know me, but you don't. And then I wonder if people, like, are more intrigued by that because they've already had a preconceived notion of who I am and then when I'm not that person. I don't know. It just really annoys me. Tell me if you guys have ever had that happen to you. Like, I don't feel like uh, I walk around being like, oh, I'm a ditzy airhead. Like, ah. Like, I know I have moments of that. But, I mean, that is a part of who I am as well. But I'm also... I also have really interesting stories. I have, you know, different tastes in music and I have just more going on in my brain besides like, ooh, what am I gonna wear today? Or like, 
I don't know what everyone thinks I am. And it just, ugh, it's just, it drives me crazy because I don't get it. And if I knew what I was doing to, I guess, lead that off, but I, but I don't. And I think that people are just very judgmental. And I guess that's just what I have to like get past. But I don't know. And I don't want to go like the opposite way and be like, you know, I don't know, try to prove people wrong or anything. Like if you, you know, get to know me, then you'll know who I am. But I don't know. Okay, sorry. Rant over. I just was having a moment and I was just listening to this song, They Say Anything. And it was kind of like how the people who had been judged the most, then they turn around and judge people. And like, and I'm just like, yeah, I think people uh, judge me being different than what I am. They think I'm like this completely different person and then once they get to know me then they realize that I'm not that person and I'm just like what does that say about you and I'm just so sick of hearing it because it's been happening so much here in Japan and I'm like am I giving off like this era of like something different than I am I don't know whatever anyways okay rant over I look normal again <laughs> it's weird how different I look with makeup on much better. Anyways, I'm about to venture outside, and I think it's like an 80% chance of rain, so that's pretty stellar. But I'm gonna do it anyways. I'm gonna bring a backpack, so if it starts raining, I can just throw my camera in the backpack. And yeah, yeah, we're gonna do it. We're gonna make make it happen. So, pretty stoked, ready to just go and explore. Got my phone charger. Not that that matters because I won't have any surface, but I'm ready. We're going to do this. Bananas. Bananas, bananas, bananas. Let's see how it goes. I'm going to go take this beautiful baby. That beautiful baby. I love when you find, I don't know how loud I'm screaming right now. Oh, don't you love how when you find your iPod from like when you were young or not even that young, but I think it was like in junior in high school. Uh, and I love listening to the music that I loved back then. On right now I'm listening to the format which it's Nate um, who I don't know he had a couple of songs out but he used to be part of the format and that's back when I loved him but anyways looking super super <laughs> touristy so let's go explore life that's about to rain help if I brought my battery useful so it is kind of sprinkling but I'm walking I don't know, down this random bridge. But I see a Ferris wheel in my future. <laughs> and I brought my wallet. I might be riding a Ferris wheel by myself. Don't care. It'd be so cool. I'm really not getting far on my walk. I don't know where I'm going. And I realized that Ferris wheel is in Odaiba, which is across the water. And I didn't really like Odaiba the last time I went there. There wasn't really that much to do. So Ferris wheel not in my future. It's not raining. But I just keep walking next to some storage units. I don't have no idea where I am. Hoping it will leave me someplace cool. But I don't know. I've been a bum all day, so I figure it's good to get out. Um, I, I'm so close to the sea, but there's all these like factory things that I don't think I'm allowed to go in. So I don't want to go because if I get screamed at, I don't even know what they're saying. Cool. So pretty. This random trail that I'm walking down. That's kind of cool. I don't know where it's going to lead me, but it's really pretty. So pretty. Uh, yeah. It's really nice. It hasn't rained. Kind of looks like it might and it is over there, but it's not where I am now. And if it does, I have an umbrella, so yeah. Just jamming out to my old uh, high school music and slightly freaking out that I could be having poison ivy on my legs or whatever form of thing Japan has. But I love it. I feel so with nature. Okay, bye. I've had no idea where I'm walking for, I don't know, I probably walked like, well, I don't know what that was, a couple miles now, but the rain is that way, so I'm walking away from the rain, clearly. It looks like there's like a nice little park up here. Um, 
So yeah, we'll see what happens. There's some people fishing, just chilling. It is so cool out here. I really like it. Um, it reminds me of. in Florida. I love it. I'm so happy. I did a good job of running away from the rain, um, but I think it's going to catch up to me. But for now, I'm just going to sit on this water and enjoy how amazing this is before I start getting bored on. There's a lot of times where I forget how lucky I am to be doing something so cool and uh, times like this that reminds me put it all in perspective and uh, yeah how that no matter where you are in the world you can find a spot that reminds you of being home and this is kind of it so yeah feel really good feel really happy that I decided to do this feel really sad about the fact that I'm gonna get poured on but I'm gonna continue walking I truly have no idea how far away I am from home but whatever invention of the world, but how pretty is that bridge? I legit just got smacked in the face so hard by the largest bug of life. Like, oh my god! It hurt! Dude, I was like, what the hell? Anyways, um, just walking. I think I'm walking in the right direction. I walked really far, so it's kind of hard to tell. But, uh, yeah, it hasn't rained, so that's nice, but it's very pretty. Um, whew, I'm pretty warm. I'm going to get home to get shower, but yeah, it's been a really, really fun day exploring. And my face freaking, dude, that hurt. Alrighty, well, I made it home. Whew, I'm exhausted. I had such a good day. I stopped by 7 Eleven to get some food. I picked up a salad oh, and chicken breast. My back is hurting. From climbing yesterday but yeah it was a good day I'm gonna throw out this trash because it's starting to stink so there's that I'm really exhausted oh I think I might take a shower and then take a little nap <laughs> 